I got here a uh, KTM 500 EXC which has fuel injected in 2020 and uh, some other years as well. And if you've ever had the problem where maybe you forget your key on and uh, you kill the battery or maybe the battery goes bad during the middle of a ride or something like that <clears throat> and you're screwed, you can't get the bike going anymore. Well, here's a little pro tip to save yourself some headaches. Go buy yourself a couple of uh, 10,000 microfarad capacitors. These ones happen to be 25 volt, but it doesn't really matter as long as it's over, say, 17 to, I don't know, 30, 40 volts. Uh, you'll uh, eliminate that problem. So here's maybe like $5 of uh, parts here uh, for a capacitor and a couple wires. Solder them up together. Put some O-rings on them, or uh, excuse me, uh, ring connectors. With a little bit of heat shrink, a couple other little smaller pieces of heat shrink here just to try to keep the water out of the leads. And uh, some ring connectors on the end. <clears throat> and make sure you're uh, aware that these capacitor capacitors have are uh, polarity sensitive, so make sure you got the negative to the negative to the ground and the positive going to the positive, otherwise you'll run into some trouble. <clears throat> And uh, then you can basically start the bike if your battery goes dead. The bike will, will stay all running also. If you disconnect that lead, this ground wire or the positive wire from the bike on the battery with this capacitor installed, the bike will continue to run. And also pliable to 690s, Enduro R's with fuel injection. Um, but yeah, there's a little pro tip for you. Awesome. Keep your dick in a vice.